signing a document with Adobe Reader has never been easier. So let's say your Avenue 2 Travel Advisor has sent you terms and conditions to sign. First things first, we want to open the email. Then we want to download the PDF. So I could double click this, but I don't want it to open the wrong program. So what I'm going to do is click this arrow, click show in folder, and now I can see where this form has been downloaded. You can see it's under downloads. I'm going to right click this so that way I can decide what program I want to open this document with. And I'm going to select Adobe Acrobat Reader DC. This is a free program and you can get this online simply by Googling download Adobe Acrobat Reader DC. And I will also link to that at the end of this video. So. Now we have opened up our document. Let's get this full screen. And so what I want to do is come up to tools and I want to select fill and sign. So it's me, I'm the one signing this. So click fill and sign. And then you'll see that this little sign option has appeared up here. So I'm going to come through the form and see where I'm expected to sign. So right here, it looks like I need an initial. So I'm going to come up to sign and I'm going to add my initials. And so I can do this in a multitude of ways. I can either type out my initials. So let's say my name is Avenue Client. I can type AC right here, or I can go to draw and I can click apply. So now you'll see this is attached to my mouse and wherever I click, it will hold. So now I'm going to scroll down a little bit more. Here's a place for a signature. I'm going to do the same thing, come up to sign. This time I'm going to add a signature. So same as before, I can type this out or I can draw my signature. Click apply and then I can place that. Anywhere that's purple means that you can click. It's editable. You can add your information. So I'm just going to type out Avenue Client here. I'm going to add the date of 07-15-2020. I'm going to scroll down. Of course, I've read all this information. I have another place for a signature. I'm going to come right back up to sign. And because I saved my last signature, I can click on that, come down here, click and place it again. So just as before, I'm going to come here. I'm going to type in my name. I'm going to add a date. And that looks like I have completed the document. So I'm going to come up to file, save as, I'm going to save this to my downloads. And I'm going to call those terms and conditions Avenue Client and save. So now I'm going to come back to my email. I'm going to reply. I'm going to come to attach. I'm going to go to my downloads, which is where I saved this. Terms and conditions, Avenue Client, attach, and send. Excuse my typo in Avenue. And that's it.